this morning. This is just so that we can all be together on Remembrance Sunday and decide exactly what we are remembering and what we wish to remember. Very, very important. So lovely to have you all with us. Thank you very much for joining us this Sunday morning. Hello, Scotty. How are we? Dinky do, Scotty La. Beachy, beachy. How very good of you to join us and a very, very warm welcome. Fantastic stuff. Lovely to have you with us. And um, thank you for joining our Act of Remembrance. Now, there will be the silence at 11 o'clock and we will keep that. But uh, good morning, Kareem. Hello, everybody. Dinky do. Thank you for your lovely TikToks. Mars, Roses, Saturn. Excellent stuff. Thank you, Kareem, for your lovely TikTok presence. Uh, we're on YouTube and we are on TikTok this morning. Uh, we're not on any other platforms. So do stick with us here, of course. If you're watching on YouTube, please subscribe and tap the bell. We're just short of 3,000 subscribers. And I can't thank you enough for all the wonderful phone-ins that we've been having. Tremendous, the phone-ins. Very, very much appreciated. So for that, I am thankful. Hey, brother, good to see you again. So John Gavin, dinky do here, here, says Scott McKinnon. Missing you on TikTok. Well, we're on right there now, John, so you get yourself on to TikTok. Good morning, Scotty. A massive shout-out to the fallen who are no longer with us and our troops who survived. Glenn Peacock from Sheffield. Thank you so much for that. Very much appreciated. Now, guys, one of the reasons I chose our act of remembrance to be on TikTok and YouTube, yes, of course, we are keeping up with the times. Yes, of course, Scotty McClue has always been ahead of his time. And other people will be perhaps putting the radio on, perhaps watching YouTube, perhaps not even bothering to do anything about remembrance. But uh, I thought we'll do it on YouTube and we'll do it on TikTok because we can be worldwide. Is that not absolutely fantastic? So I'm looking forward to hearing our friends in Canada and America and Australia and New Zealand and South Africa and uh, India and uh, Africa and all around. Hello from Livingston, dinky do. Is that a pocket watch, Scotty? Uh, well, no, it's something else very special. I can tell you. So there we are. We have that for you this morning as well. Tremendous. There we go. Thank you very much. And uh, hello from Northern Ireland. Uh, be happy. We love having you with us from Northern Ireland. A very, very good morning to you on this Remembrance Sunday. Are you no longer on TikTok? I'm on TikTok right now, John. Right this second. If you go to at Scotty McClue on TikTok, you will find me. All right. Yes, that's amazing. Yes, here in Australia, says John. Dinky do. Absolutely. I'm in Hong Kong currently, says Scott. Scott, this is wonderful. We are joining hands around the world. Hello, Dinky do. Hello from Canada. Thank you, my good sir. Not at all be happy. Lovely to have you with us. Scotland forever. Yes, I imagine we'll have Scotland forever. There we are. A dinky do. Good morning, Scotty. You're looking smart. Well, I think it's the least you can do. I mean, somebody told me that the way you dress is as a mark of respect for who you're going to see. And I'm coming to see all of you. And also a huge mark of respect for our absent friends who are no longer with us. For whatever reason, either through dying in battle or just passing on to the next step. England till I die. Well, Arjun, you see, I don't really hold too much with all this because one country is not any better than another. They are just different. So there we are. Fantastic. Can you share the YouTube to let everybody know we're live for remembrance? Uh, do let us know if you would like to remember anybody in particular. I, of course, would like to remember all my family and those that de died in war as well, particularly Uncle Colin McVicker, who went down with the harvester, HMS Harvester, on the 11th of March, 1943, in the Battle of the Atlantic. Dinky do. Hey, brother, how are you? Scotty, what do you think of the disrespect of Celtic fans? In what 
respect are we talking if you're part of the pun? There we are, dinky do, absolutely. Thank you very much, Hill Hill, says uh, Kyle. There we are, Hill Hill. Can I phone you, Scotty? I need to speak to you. I have a concern to raise. Well, you can phone me, Martin. You obviously can't phone me during the silence at 11 o'clock. But uh, God bless you, Scotty. I hope you have a great day, buddy. Thank you, Chris. Very, very good of you. And very, very much appreciated. If you've just joined us on YouTube, a very warm welcome. Make sure you subscribe and tap the bell. Can every single one of our TikTokers make sure you've followed me, please? Very, very important. And uh, it's the least we can do, I think, is follow Scotty McClue. I believe everybody on TikTok should follow Scotty McClue. If you read my TikTok bio, just below it is a link to the YouTube channel. If you would like to click on that, subscribe and tap the bell, you'll get your notifications for the internet phone-in. The internet phone-in is obviously a phone-in program that's been running for eight weeks, and it's huge. You should be part of it. Uh, absolutely. So there we are. So Martin, if you would like to give us a quick call, then do. Scotty, send him down the swanee. Which one? Who should we send down the swanee? Which particular little troll? Shout out a remembrance. Uh, so there we are, says Dave Dan. Yes, indeed, Dave, that's football. Nothing to do with remembrance. My grandfather was a prisoner of war. I have so much respect for our past and our present military. Be happy. We give you thanks for that. Thank you. That's his name. Be happy uh, as well. <clears throat> How are you today? I think this Scotland Forever guy had better just go down the swanee, actually. It's obviously a troll. There we are. It's probably from England. That's it. Right. Wonderful. John Boyle from Port Glasgow. My two grandfathers were in World War II. Were you in the military? My family were all in the military, and I have, shall we say, military connections. Uh, so there we have it. Fantastic. Now then, <laughs> John Boyd, Inky you do. My both grandfathers were in the First World War and in the Second World War. And uh, grandfather was in the Home Guard in the Second World War. My father was in the Home Guard because the Home Guard was whether you were too young or too old to fight. And then at 18, my father was conscripted and went off to fight for six years between 18 and 24. There we are, fantastic. Now then, how's your day going? My day is going beautifully, thank you, AVA. Uh, Kareem says, Dinky Doo, let us all stand, think and reflect of the brave souls that have lost their lives. Let us shine light on their darkness and may we never ever forget. God bless to the believers. Kareem, what a lovely, lovely thing to say. I thank you so much. If you've just joined us on TikTok, dinky do, uh, look at my TikTok bio, get onto the YouTube channel, subscribe and tap the bell. Lest we forget, says S. Mackay. Thank you, Shona, for sending me Mercury. That is such a beautiful thing. I love it. And of course, Mercury is my planet. Mercury is my leader. On this day, my grandfather would be carrying the colors for Remembrance Sunday. Beachy, beachy, we salute him. If you would like anybody remembered, guys, then for goodness sake, feel free to say. We can also take the odd call. We're not a phone in as such this morning because, uh, you know, it is an act of remembrance. But having said that, I see no reason. I see no reason why we can't have a wee chat. There we are. So there you are. So, Martin, the phones are on. If you'd like to, uh, wait till we just check. I'm pretty sure the phones are on. Yes, there you are. Yes, the phones are on, Martin. If you'd like to give us a wee call, there'd be no problem with that, as far as I can see. There we are. The Scots Guards. Absolutely. We salute the Scots Guards. Tremendous. Right, here we are. Good morning, Martin. Morning, my man. How are you? Very well, absolutely. Thank you for joining us for our act of remembrance this Sunday morning. Uh, uh, sorry for not phoning in last night. Um, the call was... Uh, I couldn't get in last night because it's very, very busy. Last See, night was an incredibly busy show, Martin. I think our busiest uh, yet. Uh, um, how long do you allow each caller, may I ask? How long does each caller get? 
I think it depends. We don't really have a limit. We did talk about five minutes per call, but sometimes people have been on, ooh, 10, 15 minutes. I mean, I think you, you yourself will have been on a good 10, 15 sometimes. Susan says to me that one of your call, one of your chats was on for 45 minutes last night from 25 past nine right through until 10 to. Oh, no, I don't think so, Martin. 45 minutes? No, we had I so many calls crazy. last night. We had, uh, we must have had about 15 or 20 people calling in last night, so I can't see how anybody could be 45 minutes. Because I was um, trying to phone in between, I tried to phone in between quarter two and Kareem was on still and I phoned with ten two and then, then I tried to phone again and again then David came in. Right, right. Well, I, I don't know. I mean, there isn't actually a limit being set, but we might set one. Basically, basically Susan was Susan was suggesting, suggesting in the chat. Um, if you like, if, if you like go over your... 10 minutes, like have a 10 minutes for each chat. That's what Susan was thinking to do to do. 10 minutes for each chat. But if, but if you go over the 10 minutes, like go to 15, 20, 25, that's classified as two calls. And that's what Susan thinks better to do. That's a very, it. very good suggestion, Martin. Yes, we're open to all suggestions. I mean, the phone-in is so very, very new. I know. You know, and it just, we'll have to just sort of think, and we do only have an hour, but if it's a very interesting call or we get into a discussion and people are enjoying the call. I mean, sometimes the chat will come up, brilliant call, loving this, things like that. You know what I mean? Uh, so um, as well, as well, Emma was saying to me as well last night, my, uh, my partner, I thought you said, I was in watching one of your chats back a couple of weeks ago, one of your chats previously, and you said you weren't going to mention football on YouTube. What made you change your mind? Well, we don't football? really mention very much football. We'll touch on it. Ah, uh -huh, I know. <laughs> mm -hmm. Do you mean the yeah. discussion? Should we ban it? Uh -huh. Well, yeah. that's a different thing. There's a difference between mentioning football and banning it. Uh -huh. You see, so we're talking about banning football. So, so there's what, there's yeah, Robert yeah. saying, I was listening, Scotty, no one was on 45 minutes. So she must have got mixed up there. Mm -hmm. So there we are. There's somebody asking, what's this? This is an act of remembrance, Menlik, for uh, Remembrance Sunday in the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland and throughout the world. You look, um, you look very, very smart, Scotty. Very, Thank very you, Martin. Smart. You're very, very kind. But discussions for the phone-in, we'll do that uh, on a phone-in night, you know? Yeah, cool, cool. Excellent. And listen, lovely to hear you, and I hope you have a good day. So, um, uh, um, 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 sorry, um, hold on, please. Hi, Scotty. Hello, love. How are you this morning? I'm very well. I'm, I can see. I can, I'm watching you. Right. Excellent stuff. Lovely. Thank you very much. Have a good day, Scotty. You too, love it. Thank you, do. Right, there we are. That's uh, that's Martin. He was discussing our phone-in show last night. Fantastic programme, guys. No, I don't think anybody could have been on for 45 minutes. I mean, we had sort of like maybe 15, 20 calls and we're only on for an hour. My first remembrance Sunday is a standard bearer, so nervous. Do not be too nervous, Horrible Histories Radio. You will be absolutely outstanding. Please don't get anxious. We don't want you fainting. There we are. Fantastic. Uh, now, good morning, Scotty. Dinky do. Yes, fantastic. John is in Australia. So sad Her Majesty can't attend Remembrance Sunday at the Cenotaph. Keith, I thought she was going to attend. Has there been a change? Follow us, everybody. Dinky do. Three days in a row, Scotty. How was the phone in last night? Dolos. The phone in last night, each one seems to get better and better. But I mean, they're all, they've all been outstanding, every single one of them, from night one. And we're now at number 77, I think it is. Uh, there is, she sprained her back, according to the news. She's injured her back, bless her. Well, she is in her 96th year. And she has just lost her husband, who was just about 100. Bless her, I say. God save the Queen. There we are. 
Uh, everybody's joining us here. Last minute decision, says Keith. Right, Keith, I understand. Fair enough. There we are. Uh, a shout out for Rodiga, please, says Dolos. Absolutely, Dolos. No problem at all. Wonderful stuff. Now, there's somebody asking if I like Iron Brew. Of course, everybody likes Iron Brew. Iron Brew, I can remember Scotland had uh, about two or three big brands, the main brands in Scotland. One was Iron Brew, the other was Tunnock's uh, Caramel Wafers and Tunnock's Tea Cakes. The other one was Radio Clyde. The other one was Scott FM, which was my radio station. And the other was Scotty McClure. So I was one of Scotland's major brands. Hopefully still am. Fantastic. Didn't you do? Now, there we go. Excellent. Thanks for your comments, guys. Uh, if you've just joined us like that poor soul that said, what's this? You're watching Scotty McClue, hashtag Flutai, first lord of the internet. This is our act of remembrance for Remembrance Sunday. And uh, thank you so much for joining us. We're going to be joining in the silence at 11 o'clock. So there we are. Everybody's loving the, uh, the tea cakes. There's some poor soul telling me I cannot attend the parade at the square, says Pepe. I caught COVID on Friday. So sorry to hear, Pepe. I hope you get strong and well quickly. Definitely still a major company, Scotty. Oh, without a shadow of doubt. There we are, Scotty McClure. There we are. Everybody knows Scotty. Two billion people worldwide know Scotty McClure. Guys, if you've just joined us, can everybody on TikTok please follow? I don't really think that's too much to ask. Also, if you look at my TikTok bio, if you can click on the YouTube link and subscribe and tap the bell, you'll get your notifications for the phone in. Thank you, I will remember. Yes, Pepe, wonderful. You can, uh, you can remember with us. I got an operation on Wednesday. Can you send me luck, Scotty? Of course I can, my volts. Good luck to you on strength and wellness. There we are. Thank you for following us, guys. That's appreciated. Scotty, I've joined the YouTube channel. Thank you, Richard. Have you subscribed and tapped the bell? There's about two and a half thousand videos there for you. It's uh, an Aladdin's cave. It's the world's best kept secret. Scotty McClure's YouTube channel, it should have 300,000 subscribers, but we've got just under 3,000. Be nice to finish this morning's live stream broadcast. Uh, that would be great. Hi, can you say hi to Caitlin? I can, yes, indeed. I uh, love you loads, Martin and Emma. Absolutely, Martin and Emma. So there we go. Chill out, everybody. Happy remembrance. Pray for the Queen to get better. Yes, God save Her Majesty the Queen, I say, and so say all of us. Remember, she's the Queen of everyone, regardless of your race, your creed, your background, your relig religion, anything like that. A great support from my regiment, my regiment Veterans Association. Pepe, hopefully you will. How long were you in the military, Scotty? I have military connections. There we are. Slightly different. My family are all in the military and the Navy. I posted on uh, social media last week that I was taught navigation by a man who had circumnavigated the world seven times. Nobody believed me. Right? But this morning on my right breast, I'm wearing his OBE. Can you all see that? Can you see that, guys? There we are, the OBE, for circumnavigating the world seven times. All right, I'll put it on here so you can all see it. There we are. It's very interesting, isn't it? If you come out with big thinking, people just don't believe you. Very, very strange, I say. There we are. I'll be doing the minute silence. Good, Martin. Excellent. We've got five minutes to go. Amazing Scotty Light, isn't it? Isn't it beachy beachy? So there we are. Now, here's a guy here who should be down the swanee. Uh, right, Dixon, you're going down the swanee for A, having an absurd handle, and B, for being a troll. We don't like trolls, Dixon. Bye bye, la. Doing the swanee with Dixon, guys. Uh, where are you from? Follow us as soon as you can. 
So there we are, lexicon lad, dinky do. I say to you, welcome, welcome. Hello from Jupiter. We love you in Jupiter, the bringer of joy, one of my favorite planets. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. If you've just joined us, a very, very good Sunday morning to you. Thank you for joining us for our act of remembrance at 11 o'clock. We will have two minutes silence. There's Shane. Shane will send you down the Swanee as well because you're just disrespectful. That's all you are, Shane. No harm, just disrespectful. You just don't get it. There's Shane gone, guys. Fantastic. Lovely. Um, now, who have we got? Hello from Australia. My family are A-K-K. -K. Excellent stuff. Knights of Australia, is that right? Scotty, I think you should play a tune in the box after the silence. Yes, I think we will do. Yes, that's what we will do after the silence. Thank you very much for joining us every day. Now, what did you major in? I majored in arts, Greg. So there you are, an arts man. Good day, Sir Scotty. Fantastic. Good day, everybody. And a big dinky do to you. Lovely to have you with us. And welcome for our act of remembrance at 11 o'clock. We have four minutes, guys. Four minutes. Massive respect to you and all the servicemen. We salute you, you sir. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, respect to you, sir. And respect to you, sir, I say. Respect to every single one of you. The man that causes the universe to continue to expand. How do you do, Mr. Clue? Kirby the Annihilator. You are such a very, very, very kind man. Can everybody watching the TikTok right now please follow me on TikTok? Start to look at the TikTok videos. Go to my TikTok bio and join the YouTube channel. You'll see the URL there. It's a live hyperlink. All you need to do is click it, subscribe, and tap the bell. If you're on YouTube right now, give us a thumbs up, bottom left-hand corner. Uh, so there we go. South Africa, super hot today, 43 degrees. Geodog, absolutely fantastic. I was proud to serve my country. Of course, Pepe, everyone is proud to serve their country. Uh, where are you from, says Gronky. I am from the universe, Gronky, but I'm in Scotland right now. There we are, down the Swanee with these people. Up the Royal Artillery. Up the Royal Artillery, says Sean. Up the Royal Artillery, Sean, we salute you, sir, on behalf of the British Army. There we are, up the Royal Artillery, and God save Her Majesty the Queen. Welcome, welcome, I say. Gronky Punch, Dinky Doo, it's Buchanan here. Lovely to have you with us, Buchanan and Dinky Doo. What medal are you winning, sir? This is the OBE. You'll see it's on my right breast because it's for my uncle who circumnavigated the world seven times and was in the water twice, torpedoed in First and Second World War and ha had his ship held captive in uh, the First World War by a German submarine. Everyone should tell people to listen to Scotty. Everybody should be listening to Scotty. Guys, we're coming up to 11 o'clock. We will go silent at 11 o'clock for two minutes and come back to you at two minutes past. You can take time in the silence to reflect on loved ones, on absent friends, on how things are going, on those who made the ultimate sacrifice and gave their tomorrow so that we can have our today. Silence just coming up very shortly and uh, we will go quiet. I will tell you exactly when and come back to you two minutes later at two minutes past 11. Silence.
and as the world falls silent as it has done since the eleventh hour of the eleventh day of the eleventh month in 1918, marking the time when the guns fell silent. I heard the audio the other day of the guns actually falling silent, stopping at 11 o'clock, and the bird song returning immediately to the battlefields where all that noise had been going on for all these years. Now, let's have a wee look here. This is very interesting. There's some very interesting comments here. There were one or two half witch saying, I think Scotty's dead. Geodog sorted them out. Here's somebody going, I'm Irish, I don't care. He obviously doesn't understand Irish history. And that de Valera, Winston Churchill said to him, you could not have done more for us if you had been in with us. Yeah, isn't that wonderful? So there we are. So there somebody doesn't understand. Let's clap and rejoice now, says Karim. So there we are. Um, there's Celeb telling him, don't you care about the 350,000 Irish Catholic men who fought in the wars? Very interesting. Yes, people trying to rake up things. So many disrespectful people, this man's gone out his way to do such a great live. Beachy Beachy, do not worry about these people because they have to live with themselves. Yes. And, uh, you know, if they're very short on intellect and IQ, if they don't understand their own history, there's not much that you and I can do right now. But we can always keep helping them. There we go. The Buchanan family from Idaho gives their silence. Show respect, show reverence for so many lives sacrificed. Geodog in South Africa, my dear, dear friend, thank you for your service. I salute you, sir. Wonderful, wonderful. I'll be doing the silence. Love your phone in. I've got 78 downloaded now, says Martin. So there we are. And of course, we will say the words, they shall grow not old as we that are left grow old. Age shall not weary them, nor the years condemn. But at the going down of the sun and in the morning, we will remember them. We will remember them. When you go home, tell them of us and say that for your tomorrow, we gave our today. In Flanders fields, where poppies grow, among the crosses, row on row in Flanders fields. So lovely to have you all with us this morning. Thank you so much. Fantastic. There we are. Over a quarter of a million Irishmen fought in the war. So sad he forgets this. I think he's not only forgotten, I think he's never, ever remembered. Or nobody would ever behave like that. Yes, I mean, that's just basic 100% disrespect, nothing to do with race, creed, colour, background, or nationality. There we are. Who's this calling Scotty McClure? Let's see. Hello? Have I got you here? Hello? You're on Scotty McClure, dinky do. Hello? Try again. We'll see if we can get you on again. There we are. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. Thank you for your service, everyone. Squeeze box next, I think, Scotty. The people who died in World War I died for nothing. It was a terrible waste of human life. Well, I don't think they died for nothing, but it was a terrible waste of human life. Yes, was it uh, 28 million people who died? I salute you, Scotty. I thank you, sir. Uh, there we go. And uh, here's Christian who just doesn't understand what's going on. You're watching Scotty McClure. We're having our act of remembrance for all the vets. There we are. Good morning from Georgia. We love having you in Georgia. Remembrance for the fallen mate. Have some respect, says Celeb. Absolutely well done, Celeb. You tell them. We will remember them. Uh, there we go. Don't forget the one quarter of a million Irish who fought and died. Our neighbour plays the last post on his bow every year. Very moving. 
Todd our dinky there, there can only be one Heidi High. And I lost my granddad and four uncles. Hello, you're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hello, Scott, my man. It's Martin again. Martin, how are you? Fine, fine. I have, um, I have um, did that minutes. I haven't done that two minutes silent. Good like for you, me. Martin. Well done. Excellent. Appreciate so, it. Um, so, how are you finding all the phone in so far? The phone ins. The phone ins oh. are just outstanding. I'm speechless. If Scotty McClue could ever be speechless, I'm speechless oh. about the phone ins. Mm -hmm. I am um, always share them a lot. Good. I, and I share them. Share everything with Scotty McClure on it. Every single person who has an internet connection should either be following Scotty McClure on TikTok or subscribed to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel for the phone. Yes. Every person with an internet connection. If you've got an internet connection, you've got no excuse for not following Scotty McClure or subscribing to the YouTube channel. Yes. Scotty, see all this. And that's worldwide, Martin. Worldwide. Uh -huh. The only reason yes. everybody hasn't is because they don't know about it yet. Uh huh. Um, the thing, the thing with TikTok, I know about all the trolls. The trolls used to bully me a lot. So I know. So well, they should bad never bad. have bullied you. They would like to all sincerely apologize. They are halfwits, and they will uh -huh. never, ever, ever get away with bullying, and they will never get away with trolling Scotty McClue. Straight down the swanee. I have, um, I have actually watched some of your, um, some of your videos, but and there's a couple of them that actually, um, it's quite funny. Um, Basically, basically, it's at you. Um, I don't know what his name was. Some that guy was screaming that that was a meaty boy, and that other person was like about saying, um, Jeff, Jeff wasn't nice to you on that night. Jeff, yeah, well, he's he's been edited out. You'll never ever hear from Jeff again because, because Jeff called you an unpleasant name, and I didn't like that. Well, it doesn't um, matter. Jeff just shouldn't even be Jeff, shouldn't have an internet connection. I know. You know, yeah, Jeff no. Jeff should not have access to the internet, and that's that. How um, often do you get trolled? Do you get trolled a lot? Do no, I don't get trolled very, very, very little, because the word gets out, you never, ever, 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 ever troll Scotty McClure. It's a rule of the internet. I know, I know. You don't troll the first lord of the internet. End of. I know. But I am going to try and phone on a Monday, if I can. Um, Keep trying to phone Martin. We'll, if we can get you on, we get you on. If we can't get you on, we can't get you on. I know, but it's easy. But 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 it's like fifty fifty. But hopefully, I'll, hopefully, I'll try and go on this week. But um, hopefully, so I am um, didn't mind. To, I, I didn't mind to get on last night because I suppose you anyway in the morning anyway. No, so of course, like, absolutely. You should never mind not getting on. It's it's taking pot luck. I mean, you were on first about six nights in a row. Uh, I know, I know. So you're laughing, so you don't have any gripes or anything to worry about? No. So, um, as uh, Monica... Um, as, you you, you do Monica, very well. You spoke to me yesterday. You've spoken to me twice today. Uh, so it's all good stuff, good. isn't it? Uh, so I am trying to make up from last night. So I know I've spoken to you. <laughs> yeah, absolutely, Martin. It's been lovely talking to you. And dinky do. Okay, um, love you, Scotty. Love you lots, dinky la. There we are, that's our Martin. There we are. Martin likes to go on for a wee chat, and we like that. So there we are. Can I have a shout-out for my mate? No D. Hendo. You don't have any mates, and they're not called that, so you can have no shout-out. What you can have, D. Hendo, is a lifetime ban as you go doing this one. ta la There we are. That's D. Hendo gone. Half wit. There we go. Fantastic. Uh, are you Sean Connery? Sean Connery has passed away. There we are. And I'm certainly not him. What a silly thing to even say. What a waste. Uh, keep up the good work, Scotty. Respect to all. Thank you, Chris. Very much so. Geodog says only the one who saw war and people like Scotty have this kind of respect. Absolutely, Geodog. Who have we got here? Oh, I can't see this. Let me see how I get this. 
Right, I can't see the phones coming up guys. Oh, there we are. Hello, you're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Thank you, dear Scotty. It's Kareem. Ah, oh, Kareem, how lovely to hear you and have you with uh, us on Remembrance Sunday. Uh, yeah, I've got you on the big screen, Scotty. Oh, I'm how's it looking? Is it all right? Perfect. I'm lying on my bed watching you just now. <laughs> but, uh, good for you, Kareem. You need a long lie. You work so hard. Thank you. So to just to say, listen, thank you very much for doing this. I, I think it's very respectful to for remembering the people, but also educating people as well out there because people on TikTok have been questioning what's going on, what's happening. I just think Well they have, really and I don't this. think we should ban people ever for questioning anything because otherwise they'd never learn. Correct. But I think but, the trolls, uh, I mean obviously the idiots that go, Hi, I'm watching you from the Lavi and I mean just away with them. They're just they shouldn't well, have internet connections. Well I think I think I've raised the comment there you can't fix stupid and no. I think that just sums it up. You'll perfectly. never fix stupid, you'll never fix that very, very, very low IQ people who have yeah. never had any basic education to speak of. Correct. You know, and I just think it was very disrespectful for the, the, these people have fought for us to have the life that we have today. Yes, and yes. Just to throw that back in their face, it is disrespectful. And they did uh, fight for a freedom, and when we were in the EU, we had 50 years of peace and prosperity. Yes. Now, we've yes. lost that, so we've had Brexit, we've had a pandemic, we've had courtesy of the government, uh, what did we have, austerity for about 12 uh -huh. years. So we've had one thing after another. So the people have really been suffering. Now, they haven't suffered in the way they suffered in two world wars, but nevertheless, they've been suffering. Yes. Well, as you know as well, Scotty, things are rising in price in society, so people yes. are really getting hurt financially as well. Well, I mean, I went for just a few messages last night, and it was huge. Yeah, yeah. You know, just well, a few wee bits and pieces, you know? Little bit did of I, cheese. Did you drive? Little bit of did cheese. Did you drive there, Scotty? Did I what, sorry? Did you drive there? Uh, did I drive there? Well, I actually did, Kareem, because I've got a dodgy yeah. knee. No, no, it was the point I was wanting to raise with that is now petrol's nearly at one one fifty, one pound fifty. Yes. Yes, well, I mean, I'm a diesel man, but it's about the same. Yeah. Well, it's a sad day when diesel's about the same price as yes. petrol, you know. Well, you see, yeah. I'll tell you where I was very annoyed, and I think it might have been the Labour government that did it. But uh -huh. they started charging the same for marine diesel. Now, right. marine diesel used to be commercial diesel. Mm -hmm. Because boats obviously use a bit of fuel. But the boats in this country, we owed such a debt to our, to our marines. Mm-hmm. You know, when I say Marines, I'm not just talking the raw Marines. I'm saying to our boats, to our whole industry. Now, you try in the west of Scotland to find boat yards, boat builders, people with boats. You've got the odd marinas, yes? But it used to be the Clyde, virtually every working person used to go on the river at some point. Right. You know, and you had yacht clubs full of little cruisers, full of converted ships, lifeboats, small wow. engines. During the war, you had Dunkirk was relieved by the little ships. And I think it was because of the little ships, if I've heard properly, that the marine diesel price was kept low. We obviously had a chancellor that didn't understand why and decided to up it to the same price as vehicles. Right. And the result is you can hardly see anybody with a marine diesel, you know? Yeah, yeah. That's, You'll get them in Ireland. You'll get yeah. them in Canada and America and Australia and New Zealand. But you won't get them on the Clyde because of the costs. So governments should look at these things and think, no, no, no. Let's give people proper leisure time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely, Scotty. You know, and I mean, the Clyde is a fantastic playground. Uh, well, there should well, never, well, ever, well, ever, well. ever have been recession in the west of Scotland because it's one of the world's great places. Yes. Oh, well, I was speaking to the plumber yesterday. You just said recession, but he said during the big recession, he felt that the big cities didn't get too much of an impact on it. 
it was more of the smaller places, like if you looked at Hamilton and Motherwell, the East Brides, they said that the smaller places got really hit. Yes, well, I think that's absolutely true because these towns, you see, when I was little, I lived in a place called Greenock, yes. about 25 miles from where you are. Now, Greenock was a bit of a boom town. It had shipyards, it had um, high tech. IBM was one of the huge employers in Greenock. So you had high tech. Um, you had all sorts of industries, semiconductors, woolen mills, the sugar industry, sugar refining, shipping, engineering. So it was just massive and there was big money in the town. And the people that ran these businesses were lovely people. They, You saw them about, they talked to you, there was no side to them, there was no class system. And I went, in fact, to school and the whole school had been built on the site of one house. And that one house belonged to Mr. Scott, the shipbuilders of Scott Lithgow. Right. Up at Langbank, you had the Lithgows. Uh -huh. And they were so generous to the town, Port Glasgow, Bill and Glen Lithgow, Sir William, uh, um, Jim and Glen Lithgow, Sir James, and, uh, and Lady Gwendoline. And they were just so generous to the town. People in Port Glasgow will know exactly what I'm talking about when the Lithgows were in town and Sir William, you know. So, you know, fantastic benefactors, all these people gave back so much to the places that had made them. And Paisley, huge engineering, shipbuilding, all that Paisley. So Paisley was a very wealthy town. Kilmarnock was a very wealthy town. The new towns, East Kilbride, Glenrothes, Cumbernauld, uh, you know, fantastic. Built there because there were businesses there. Dumbarton, Dumbarton was absolutely covered in shipyards. You know, Danoon. And all these towns have suffered dreadfully by Westminster sucking the life out of Scotland. The worst was actually Margaret Thatcher. Yeah. You know, sucking the life out of Scotland, taking the businesses down south because it made her look good to the voters. And the south, of course, was overheating. You couldn't really get a great lifestyle in the south. You couldn't get on the roads, certainly not during rush hour. Meanwhile, the rest of the country was bereft. So now we need to have a government and a prime minister and a chancellor that actually start sharing that out across the nation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I've got that Scottish. And then the dollar. price of a house in the West End of London should be the same as the price of a house in the West End of Glasgow. Yes, but yeah, yeah. Well, I think we've thought about this before, and I won't go into it just now because I know it's Remembrance Day, but. It is Remembrance Day, but we've had a lovely act of remembrance, Kareem, and you're very welcome to have a discussion. Thank you, Scotty. I, I was going to say there about uh, obviously the benefits if we have independence and everything that you said, I believe, can be challenged. We've got the foundations put down to progress, but that will be for another day, another discussion. <laughs> another day, another dollar. Lovely to talk to you. Thank you very much, Listen, Kareem. Thanks again for coming on today and doing that, and I'll speak to you tomorrow night. Many blessings, day. sir. I salute Bye. you. Wonderful Ooh. fellow. That's uh, Kareem, one of our great callers, the wonderful Keith Snedden has just sent me five pounds. He's gone on to the YouTube channel. He's tapped the dollar at the bottom of the super chat and sent me five pounds. Unless he's gone on to buy me a pie at the top. I don't know. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Keith. Paid my respects to our fallen heroes, says Gordon. At the British War Ceremony today in the Kanchaburi River Kwai, in the presence of a few old soldiers. The River Kwai, bridge over the River Kwai. Thank you, Gordon Gorman, for doing that, and thank you for sharing it with us. The main impetus behind our act of remembrance this morning on TikTok and YouTube is the fact that we're worldwide. So your mainstream broadcasters can only manage to be within the United Kingdom, Great Britain, Northern Ireland. We are worldwide 
right now. And there's Gordon, who's paid his respects at the River Kwai, at the Kanchaburi River. There we are. Fantastic. Darren here, dinky do Salute to all veterans of the Allied Forces. Thank you for following us. It's a Scottish Glen Gary, very traditional, says Geodog. Thank you. Jesus loves you. Yes, indeed. We will remember them. Doing the Swanee for the half-wits and disrespectful trolls. He's got a restraining order in three districts, that guy. Quite right. Did you serve in the armed forces? Let's just say I have military connections. There we are. What's your favourite drink, uh, favourite alcoholic drink? Uh, nothing, because I don't drink alcohol. I drink Scottish water. Cheers, I say. Right, what have you got here? Respect to your big man. The Buchanan family in Idaho. Dinky do. Um, now, who have we got? What did this guy say wrong? Uh, he said, now, what did he say wrong? Oh, yes, he wanted me to shout out to some disrespectful name he'd made up so that it would make a fool of me. That's what he did wrong. Uh, so there we go. Fantastic. Now, who else have we got here? What regiment badge is that, Scotty? That's my own. I have my own march past. So that's my own. That's the hand of justice. There we are. But this hat used to have an Argyle and Sutherland Highlanders badge in it. There we are. Is it true you voted? No. There we are. Right, who we got here, guys? Neptune and Venus. Can I thank the beautiful TikTokers for the wonderful gifts? You're so kind. Can I also ask that everybody on TikTok follows Scotty McClue? Can I also ask that you go to my TikTok bio and tap the link for the YouTube channel? Go on, subscribe, and tap the bell. I bet some of you don't, but I'd be very grateful if you would. It's not a big ask. Thank you very much. You get Scotty McClue free six nights a week. So there we are. There is absolutely no charge. I think the least that decent human beings can do is follow me on TikTok and subscribe to me on the YouTube channel. Uh, it's all set up for you, so there's no problem. Uh, the semiconductor industry is hush hushed. Um, there we are. Yes, indeed, Dolores, I am sure. There's a man who likes his scotch. Well, Hamish, I don't drink alcohol. There's usually scotch in alcohol or alcohol in scotch. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Scotty is, Scotty is, Scotty is, Scotty Martin again. Yes, Martin. Yes, Somebody wrote a comment on your YouTube saying, stick your poker when the sun doesn't shine. That's really unrespectful. Well, it's they're very, very half-witted. We'll give them a lifetime ban. Yeah, you should. I'll just give them a lifetime ban now. Because that is totally unrespectful. Very disrespectful, but very, very low IQ as well. I know. But so there we are. So that's it gone. You'll never see that again. Good, thank there's, you. That's somebody that doesn't understand their own history. There's a, there's, there's a lot of people out there that don't understand your show. If they, um, well, they um, don't, but they should watch it. and listen. That would be the intelligent thing to do. Yes. And if, the sun if, um, shines everywhere with me, so it doesn't matter. So if people don't understand... Don't, don't watch the show then, but I am trying my best to share it all for you and I'm watching all the... Basically, you and you and you st they stop at dogs. You have um, still got 2.98 disciples still, and I'm still watching it every day. Excellent. But, um, well, you'll just I'm have to forgive Aaron. Aaron doesn't know anything about the history of his own country. I know. Yes. He doesn't understand that Winston Churchill thanked his president and praised him to the heights for his good work. Uh -huh. So there we are. That's poor Aaron. No, a knower of nothing. Um, would you eventually go, go back on Twitter again and do your, do your phone in? Would uh, you, well, you, you can't, on? Martin, because I don't think they've got that facility. Uh -huh. You see what I mean? The only because reason I came off it, because Twitter's fabulous. Everybody feel free to follow me on Twitter, at Scotty McClure. 
And I follow you on Instagram as well. I find you on Instagram as well. Instagram and as I'm well, on. Martin, yes. And uh, Reddit. I don't know if you're on Reddit. Scotty underscore McClure. So how did I so how so how did I how did I sorry how did I download that? I, I think you just download Reddit. It's a huge thing. Mm -hmm. R-E-D-D-I-T. Uh, so it's um, an app, I. It's what, what? It's an um, app. It's an app, yes, yes. Yes, R-E-D-D-I-T. Cool. I don't use uh, it. I don't use it a lot, but we're on there. But the big one is YouTube. We need everybody with an internet connection to subscribe uh -huh. to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel. They can look it up. Uh, good, good, good. So, um, your phone has been fantastic. Um, there's a lot of ups and downs and funny bits of watch by back. Yes, um, yes. I mean, a lot of it's quite good. We don't set out to be funny, but people say it's extremely funny. I think the funny part that I like every time when Meta Boy comes on and starts his, <laughs> his police Starts, starts his on. nonsense. There's Hi. somebody shouting up the Royal Artillery. There we uh -huh. are, fantastic. Lovely. The International Royal Artillery. Have a great day, Scotty, lest we forget all our brave heroes. Absolutely. Yes, and a big thank you to all of our Irishmen who fought for the, the country. There we are, tremendous stuff. So Hard border in the that? Irish Sea between the north of Ireland and the UK. So are you going to upload this as well, eh? Oh yes, of course, it gets uploaded. Absolutely. Uh, I have to download it and add it, add it to my collection and that. I think you should, yes it did. Yeah, I am, because, because I think today's been the best one. Because well, there's the, somebody the, asking your thoughts on Joe Biden farting in the presence of the royals. Well, I think what he should have done was, uh, you know, turned round to one of his aides, and said, would you mind stopping that? And uh -huh. his aide could have said, yes, Mr. President, which way did it go? Uh -huh. I was in New York for my 21st. I left New York um, five days later, and the Twin Towers got blown up when I oh, left. Oh, my goodness me, you should have come on. I think the only phone-in that still survived on the night of the Twin Towers their risk, risk averse people had taken their phone ends off the radio and Scotty McClure's had gone on because my boss understood. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. But I've been um, watched a wee um um I've watched a wee chat on your um on one of your visuals and you're speaking to a cheeky a lady who's quite cheeky, it's called a cheeky lady. Very, very, cheeky very lady. cheeky lady. Oh. Oh. There's a uh, helmet says I remember you from the radio when you were on Century, isn't that lovely? But why? Why was she cheeky to you? What I don't you? know. You would need to ask her, Martin. Nobody know, should ever I'm... cheek up to Scotty McClure. I know, because because I, I know. Oh, I know. I know what she was doing. She was calling you um, FAT a lot. And right. you were trying to say... Yeah, well, we don't trying... want that. Eh? We don't want that, Martin. I know, I know. Listen, I know. I'll have to go. We're running out of time. Dinky do. Okay, Thank you, love you. Love you lots. There we are. That's our Martin on for a wee chat. Uh, so there we are. You're giving too much attention to trolls as dollars. No, we're not dollars. We're sending them doing this money. Thank you, do from Auckland, New Zealand. Stuart, I told you, I had relatives in matter, matter. There we are. Joe Biden was too gassy in the presence of the royals. The royals are very, very, very experienced people. And I'm sure they will have been able to deal with that. So there you go. There we are. Thank you very much. Um, can you bagpipe solo? No. Are you by any chance from Scotland? I am, just by chance, yes. Would you like a tune? First Battalion, the Royal Highland Fusiliers. Excellent, Pepe. Ayrshire Regiment, Princess Margaret's own. Lovely. Used to be the Highland Light Infantry and the Royal Scots Fusiliers, based in Maryhill Barracks, where I lived for 11 years. There we are, well, round the corner. Would you like to tune in the squeeze box, guys? Thank you. 
And we also have that as our salute to the fallen for our act of remembrance this morning. Thank you so much for coming to join us. Five and a half thousand likes on TikTok. Please, every TikToker, get following Scotty McClue. We must get that up. So there we are. Lovely to hear from you, Pepe, from the 1st Battalion Royal Highland Fusiliers. Have you read Team It's Only Radio by John Myers, the funniest book I've ever read? Helmet, apparently there's a chapter on Dinky Doo in the book. So there we are. I remember John Funning to ask me if it was all right to put it in. Can we all just appreciate how well he rolls his R's? There we are. Fantastic. Are you talking about President Biden? There we are. Uh, Biden farting in front of the rolls demonstrates a great deal of respect. Uh, the man's elderly, the geo dog, and perhaps couldn't actually hang on to it. So, in fairness, do you know what I mean? I don't think it was intentional. I don't think he'd be saving it up. Uh, I didn't know Biden was with the rolls. Uh, yes, he met Charles and Camilla in Glasgow this week at the COP. There we are, the massive conference, COP26. What college you graduated? Several colleges. The Royal Scottish Academy of Music and Drama, the Royal Conservatoire of Scotland, Glasgow University, Strathclyde University, Jordan Hill College, the James Watt College. There we are, Squeezebox, Scotty, brilliant. Is that you in the picture behind? Magic. Yes, indeed. Very well done on the accordion. There we are, good energy. Keep smiling. Thank you very much. So there we go. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Getting mixed up there. Fantastic. Uh, ah, Scotty Dinky Doo, you're looking well and smart. We must dash. Bye-bye to our beautiful TikTokers. ta -ra -las.